All right, some things to note comparing the output from the previous version of Gemini 2.5 Pro to this latest updated version. It seems like a slight improvement from last time, but not like a leaps and bounds improvement from what we saw, at least giving it the same exact prompt. Some differing things that happened here is it didn't pick up on that dependency that it called out to use the CSERF module. Instead, it created its own thing and didn't rely on that package. So maybe that's a sign that it's recognizing that the CSERF module or package is deprecated and it shouldn't use that actually in the code. I'm just speculating though on that one. In addition to that, it went a different route in terms of database usage. It's the previous model used Mongo. And again, you can go see the video on this one if you want to check out the results of that one. But it used a Mongo database where in this one we're using SQLite. And last but not least, the difference in this newest one is it actually implemented the authentication flow and logging in, logging out, registering. And there were no issues with going through that other than logging out, we ran into that one bug. So overall, pretty good in terms of like the output of the code and being kind of production ready in a sense. And then from a security standpoint, it's all been medium level severity vulnerabilities that may or may not be truly impactful to the code running in production, but something to at least be aware of and look into further so that we can make sure we are not actually susceptible to these vulnerabilities that are being reported to us.